Welcome back. Today, we're talking about Gentech Security Center licensing. If you missed our previous video on installing the software, don't worry. We have a complete playlist covering the entire process. Let's get your Gentech Security Center up and running with the right licenses. Licensing is crucial for unlocking Gentech Security Center's full power. In this video, we'll guide you step by step ensuring you can access all the features and maximize your security solution. Before we start, check out our previous video on installing the software, and if you find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Let's dive into Gentech Security Center licensing. After installing the security center on the main server or promoting an expansion server to a main server, it's important to activate your security center license. Let's begin the video. The licensed user should open the server admin by right-clicking on its desktop icon and selecting Run as Administrator. The server admin will open in a web browser. Enter the login credentials. Once logged in, you may notice that the license status is red, indicating no licenses have been applied to the Gentech Security Center. To license the software, double-click on License and the license management window will appear. In the license management dialog box, there are two available options, web activation and manual activation. We recommend using the web activation method to avoid conflicts and other issues. However, in the upcoming videos, we will learn how to activate the license manually. Once you select web activation, please enter your system ID and password. Your system ID, and password can be found in the Security Center License Information document provided by the Gentech Customer Service Team upon product purchase. Before you click on Activate, make sure your server is connected to the Internet, then click Activate. It will take a few seconds to activate the license. Once the activation is completed, your license information will now be displayed in the license section of the server admin overview page. And the indicator beside the license is now green, indicating that the license is activated. However, there is another service, directory, which is currently shown in red. Until all three services have a green indicator, you won't be able to use the security center or any applications. In the next video, I will explain why it's not starting and how to resolve the issue. Hope you understand how to activate the license for Gentech Security Center software, latest and older versions, using web activation. And that's a wrap for today's video. I hope you found the information on activating the license for Gentech Security Center software using web activation helpful. Remember, by following the steps we discussed, you'll be able to unlock all the features and functionalities of the software, ensuring a seamless experience. If you have any questions or need further assistance, please don't hesitate to leave a comment below. I'll be more than happy to help you out. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more useful tutorials and tech-related content. And if there's a specific topic you'd like us to cover in the future, let us know in the comments. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Stay secure.